You guys know I have become the youngest brain surgeon ever to exist in bit life, okay? And the amount of comments I have gotten to become Mr. Sheldon Cooper himself, aka also young Sheldon, is insane. Come become a patron and join the Patreon community where you can get exclusive videos that will not be posted onto YouTube and unlock early access to my new podcast, Lost and Loud. Now, I grew up watching Big Bang Theory, one of the best shows ever, but I watched it a long time ago, so I didn't remember much. So I'm really glad I got your guys' help with coming up with this criteria. We know Young Sheldon is a new show today. I have not watched it, but after reading the criteria, for this I really want to watch it now but here we have the young Sheldon life recreation in honor of the golden diploma okay <laughs> look at this guy how do you not love him <laughs> the little bow tie I'm dead and you guys already know your girl's notes on her digital planner link down below thank you very much so mr young sheldon here's the criteria let's get started first we have to be born a male named Sheldon Cooper obviously <laughs> Then we're going to be born in Medford, Houston. I don't think that's in the game, so we're just gonna pick like a random city pretty much. We have to have 100% smarts. We are not settling for freaking 70, 75, 80. It is young Sheldon. Thank you very much. 100. <laughs> then we have to have five friends, okay? Penny, Leonard, Raj, Howard, and Bernadette. So shout out to the person in my comment section who helped me with this challenge. I love reading your guys' requests in the comments. That's where I get a lot of my video ideas. So always feel free to comment something. Then we have to have a friend named Tam Nguyen in high school and then unfriend him. I don't remember Tam. I'm not sure if that had to do with young Sheldon more, but I don't remember Tam in Big Bang Theory. So we'll see. I saw multiple comments of this. They said, don't get a driver's license, but then someone said actually get one. But the thing is, is he just never uses it. So that's pretty much what we're gonna do because I originally wrote, don't get one. So we're gonna get one, but we're never gonna get a car or anything or use it for anything. Then we actually have to drop out of high school at 16 and get a physics degree because the whole point is, is like you graduated early, but a bit life you can't do that. So in order to do that, we're gonna golden diploma this <laughs> Then we have to become a physicist. So um, your girl has to figure that out. <laughs> How to do no that in idea. bit life. Because in case you weren't aware, um, there's no such thing as physicists in bit life. So I'm gonna <laughs> find something that is the closest I can to it, okay? But then what's next is we have to befriend a professor named John Sturgis, uh, but unfortunately there's no way we can specifically pick friends that are professors, right? So pretty much what we're gonna do is probably just befriend a coworker and name them John. Then we have to buy a condo, as we know, the iconic condo. Then we have to marry a girl named Amy. <laughs> Farah Fowler, okay, our future wife, and finally have a kid named Leonard. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm so excited to start this. I just want to be a little genius boy with a bow tie, okay? I really want to do this. Look at this face. We got to do it. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> it's already done. <laughs> So we have Sheldon here. We are a male. I made it from Nashville. Okay, whatever. Houston, Texas, Nashville, Tennessee. I'm Canadian. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, special talent. I don't have one because our special talent is our smarts. So that's not really something we can choose. So this is our appearance. Okay, and our attributes. Okay, look at that. Smarts, 95. No, 100. Thank you. Okay, safe. What are you gonna do about it? <laughs> Start Sheldon's life. I was born a male in Nashville, United States, and I was conceived on my parents' honeymoon. Love it. <laughs> my birthday is April 16th. I'm an Aries. My name is Sheldon Cooper. My mother is Vivian, a midwife. My father is Fabian, a mail carrier. And we have a puffy cat named Bailey. <laughs> puffy cat, okay. Be born a male named Sheldon. Done. Be born in not this city, done. Have 100% smarts. That is a freaking given. Thank you very much. Yeah, there he is. There he is. He's serving. So all we have to do is have our five friends. I think we're going to make them in elementary school, maybe. Just because I want them to be our lifelong friends. You know, it's more so focusing on his journey as a kid. So we're going to do that. My mom has itchy bottom and I have whooping cough. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. I've accepted my fate. I can't do this. Please. Please. Okay, I lived. I lived. I have pneumonia. Why is this my life already? This is supposed to be good. Whooping cough and pneumonia. What did I do in my past life to deserve this? Okay, so we're cured of our pneumonia and whooping cough. <laughs> Let's just keep going. How much worse can it get? I don't think it could, honestly, at this point. Okay, we're officially in elementary school. So basically, we're just studying harder every year. And I want to make my friends. Let's, let's see. Okay, let's befriend... Marvin, he called me fly. Hey, bestie. 
doesn't want to be my friend, bruh. bruh. The audacity. Okay, what about Walt? Okay, we're friends with Walt. Let's be friends with Chloe. Now we're going to be friends with, let's say, Clarence. Well, I'm complimenting him first, but he better be my friend. Thank you. We're just going to make Mitch or Leonard, probably. Great. Okay, now it's time to change the characters. So Walt is going to be Raj. Chloe is going to be Penny. Oh my god, I forgot about Bernadette. Um, Let's go with Lysandra. Clarence is going to be Howard. Okay, so we officially have our friend group. We have Raj, Penny, Howard, Leonard, and Bernadette. So we're going to meet Amy later. We're going to marry her. We're going to have our little baby. Okay, let's do this. Let's just keep studying harder for school. And I'm hoping to maybe join science club if we can when we're older. Maybe I should have a good relationship with my teachers. I'm not sure. Not my PE teacher. The principal. We're gonna suck up to him. Let's do <laughs> You left a gift card for McDonald's on the principal Mr. Witherspoon's desk. Listen, if getting gift cards from my students means being a teacher, I think I'm in the wrong career field. <laughs> I don't get gift cards. I just want gift cards to Indigo and Amazon. <laughs> False claim. While playing in the neighborhood, your friend Leonard tells you to fake a fall on your neighbor's driveway because then you can sue them. Why is that so Leonard coded? <laughs> Why? <laughs> That's a great idea. Oh, it's as if I didn't get any money. Please. Please. Piano. I wonder if Sheldon plays any music. I feel like they would have mentioned it if it was like a big part of his storyline. The main thing is like he's literally a freaking child genius and it's insane. Pneumonia. Again, I literally had it at three. <laughs> What did I do to deserve pneumonia? The next friend we have to make is not until we're in high school. And we're doing great right now. Our smarts are up, our grades are up. Middle school, okay, it's time to join a club. Please have science club. No, no there's no science club. Okay, we're gonna do math club then. Yeah, <laughs> sounds good. Raj wants to be best friends, yay. Okay, so we're officially 12, so now we can spend time with everyone. So this is gonna be like our little time in the apartments and stuff or the condo where we're all just interacting. Everyone's kind of, it's like how Friends was where everybody kind of just lives near each other and just hang out every day. Math club, we're gonna be secretary, yes. I'm just annoyed we didn't get science club. Hopefully in high school we do. We're officially in high school, okay. Let's see what we have to offer. There's no freaking science club. You know what, I don't need you. <gasps> environment club i don't need you though okay so we have to make our like enemy even though he's not our enemy um tam win so let's just pick stanley blue tree nice to meet you your name is gonna be tam okay we have tam win we're probably gonna unfriend him once we graduate because we're only in high school till we're 16 so let's keep studying harder my parents keep giving me siblings they need to chill Thank you. Okay, we're 16, we're treasurer. As we know in the notes, we have to get our driver's license, but then never actually use it. So we passed, we're good. And guys, it's time to drop out. This is happening. It's time. We are dropping out of high school and it's time to use our golden diploma. Okay, so we have to be a physicist, but the thing is, I'm not sure if it's here. <gasps> physics it is we graduated from university with an undergraduate degree in physics okay so the main issue is that there's literally no physicist job though that's the thing it doesn't exist there's not even like a scientist job there's a forensic scientist but that's completely different there's like a biologist but that has nothing to do with physics you know what i mean completely different areas um let's just look for a job i don't know we could be in a <gasps> an environmental scientist actually we might be too young shut up we got it do you have any questions for us where do you see the company in five years we got it we got it okay so we're not able to be a physicist in bit life but that's okay there's not like i would have been a scientist if we could but you know what we did it so we had our friend named tam win we did get our driver's license but the goal is to never actually use it so no drive-bys guys <laughs> now we dropped out of high school at 16 we got our physics degree we became a scientist you know what i mean and now what we have to do is make our new friend john buy our condo, marry our queen, Amy, and then have our kid named Leonard. And that will be Mr. Young Sheldon. Now turned older Sheldon. We are changing. We are turning into the adult Sheldon. Let's just live our best life right now. We're 16. We're thriving. It's time to eliminate Tam Wynn because we have beef with him for some reason. You guys need to let me know in the comments what happened with Tam. So let's just unfriend him. Toodles, have a nice life, Tam. No hard feelings, unless there are hard feelings I don't know about. Um, <laughs> let's see, Penny wants to be best friends, but we're already best friends with Raj. I'll agree, I'm sorry, Penny. I'm sorry, Queen. Let's just keep working harder at our job. I'm gonna wait till we're 18 to see if anything happens. Oh, my cat died. Have her taxidermy, she'll be with me for life now. <laughs> John Sturgis, let's just find who John's gonna be. Keenan. 
Okay, befriend him. I'm, I'm great at making friends. <laughs> Okay, you, sir, are going to be John Sturgis. Thank you very much. Baraj, we substituted his orange juice with water and Kraft mac and cheese powder. That is so cruel. Can you imagine you like have an iced cup and you are pouring that orange juice and you are thinking you're gonna have the most cold, crispy orange juice ever and it's savory cheese powder. <laughs> Poor guy. I think we gotta pull a prank on Leonard too. We place a fake rat next to your friend Leonard. I don't think Leonard would mind that, to be honest. It's got a nice little gift. A gallon of milk. You never know when a friend needs a gallon of milk. <laughs> God, we have a runny nose. I swear if it's cerebral spinal fluid, I swear my luck. Common cold. Okay, maybe I'm just a hypochondriac. Sorry. Overtime. Okay, we will do it. Anything to get promoted to look good. My coworker wanted to be my friend. No. <laughs> I have enough friends. There we go. We got promoted to senior environmental scientist. Thank you very much. Sheldon is at the top of his career. He's thriving. 16 year old environmental scientist. Thank you very much. <laughs> but now what's next is we have to officially get a condo, but we got to make a little bit more money because we only have 122,000 in the bank. So your girl's going to age till she's at least 25. You discovered that your best friend Penny, who stayed at your house last night, used your sex toy. Wow. This is giving Big Bang Theory to a T. I'm actually. <laughs> Toss it out. Let's, we're just not bringing it up. I feel like Sheldon would get so uncomfortable. He'd be like, he like would either never tell her or literally go up to her. Penny, um, why is my sex toy used? Oh. He'd do one of the two. He'd either completely ignore it or literally be like, Penny, I don't understand why my sex toy is on the counter. Um, I remember I last left it uh, in the drawer for three months ago, but it is on my counter. Do you think someone broke into my apartment to like test her? And she'll be like, yeah. Sheldon, like maybe, and be like, actually, I know it was you. <laughs> Let's go to a concert with Miss Bernadette, okay? Great, thriving. And I'm gonna prank Leonard, cause that is self care for me. Let's prank him again. You created a text shortcut in your friend's phone so that whenever he types the words, thank you, it changes to dirty expletive. <laughs> Our friends want us to join OnlyFans. <laughs> Everybody join Sheldon Cooper's OnlyFans. <laughs> Wait, John doesn't like me. What did I do to you? We're supposed to be friends through sickness and in health, better or for worse. Come on, our vows. We took best friend vows. What's, what's the problem? Let's give him a nice little gift, some diamond earrings. Let's go to a concert with him too. Eminem, who doesn't want to go to that? Now let's see the condo prices. What exactly we need to get one. Futuristic home, Um, can't afford that. Oh, condo, 115,000. We actually were good the first time. Buy with cash, girl. Okay, we got our condo, so now we gotta meet our wife. <laughs> I have to marry a girl named Amy Farah Fowler, and I'm going to marry one of my coworkers because she's a scientist too, right? So let's go find our wife. Amy, where art thou? Where is she? Kayla. She hates me. <laughs> what did I do to you? Layla, okay? We complimented her, and now we're going to ask her out. She said her socioeconomic statuses don't align. What? We work the same job. Maybe that's why. Okay, she rejected me. I'm just gonna wait till we get a better coworker. <laughs> okay, John is asking me to go to a holiday work party. Okay, while well, I'm in, you hated me last year. I don't know why. Are you on Tam Wynn's side? You're still sitting on Sheldon's side. John. Okay, you know what? We're just gonna try for Jezelyn. Okay, we're gonna compliment her. We're gonna seduce her. Wait, I need to see if she's single first. Okay, okay, we're good, we're good. Let's ask her out. <gasps> ah! We found our Amy. Okay, okay. Amy, Farah, Fowler, let's go, let's go. We found our girl and I just have to give us a brown hair. Oh my God, I'm living for this. We found our wife. So now that we found our lovely Amy, all that's left is have our kid. You come home from a manicure. Sheldon's thriving. Hey. Discover your girlfriend has taken $900 out of your dresser and gone to look at cars for sale. Listen, you're gonna be wifey, so I'm gonna say it's okay because my money's your money, sweetheart. <laughs> It doesn't bother me, okay? Now I'm gonna propose because <laughs> my money's your money, okay? Um, thank you. That car is now ours if I propose. So thank you for buying me a car. Okay, let's propose at a field of tulips. She rejected me. I mean, Amy's a smart woman, so she's like, what are you doing? Where's the ring? I'm spending my entire bank account on it casually. 
<laughs> Never do that. Be. Never buy someone a ring if it's your entire bank account, please. Botanical garden. That's good. That's satisfying. Okay, now let's have an amazing wedding. Let's go to Germany Country Club. I can't afford it. So a restaurant in Jamaica can do that. Ooh, she wants a prenup. Amy is smart, okay? She's a scientist. Um, Agree, girl. I just want to be with you. I'm changing my name to Sheldon Fowler because we love her. <laughs> that is my wife. I got her debt. Okay, well, anyways, time to have baby. Great, golden pacifier. Um, Special talent, sports for Leonard. Let's do it. Let's have our little baby boy. Yay, Deborah oh, Leonard, Mr. Leonard Fowler. Love to see it. A little baby boy. And there we have it, guys. That is our life with Sheldon Fowler. And we are in an insane amount of debt. I think it, maybe it's because we have a mortgage. We have two homes. She has a penthouse. What? Girl. Girl, she has a penthouse. Okay, it makes sense. We weren't in debt. She just has a penthouse. Married the right woman. God. Well, guys, that was officially the Young Sheldon Challenge complete. Always remember in the beginning of the video, you can just take a screenshot of like my notes and stuff if you want to be able to save the criteria for another day. But thank you guys for recommending this. This is really fun. It really brought me back to like my childhood growing up watching Sheldon and Leonard and Penny and all of them. This definitely made me want to watch the show Young Sheldon. Just remember guys, you can always leave me video requests in the comments down below. I'm always checking my comments. And if you guys want to be able to use the same note templates I use, I have a digital planners, undated note templates. Everything's on my Etsy shop. So you guys can go check that down below. But with that being said, I'll just see you guys in the next one. Thank you for watching.